what's up guys i'm back with another video and today as you can tell from the title we are reading fairy tale 100 year quest chapter 67 i think i haven't went on the website that i use and looked at it but i'm ready to just get straight into this video i excuse me for how i look because i think i look really ratty today and honestly it's been a long day also um for everyone that's from wattpad I literally have $790, I just checked, and that's like mind-blowing that I'm, if I hit 800, I'm like 200 followers away from, what's it called, 1,000. But thank you guys. Um, so let's hurry up and go to the website I use and go ahead and start reading the chapter. So I almost thought that we wasn't going to get a chapter this week because like usually my Instagram page is stacked with fairy tale content depending on what happens in the new chapter that's how i really started reading this again but um it just came out and i literally just checked but here's a quick recap for everyone so toka transported them all to well not toka the white mage or whatever she transported them all to edelis and they met their edelis friends and they all met nasha and Gregi, i think is how you pronounce it Someone taught me how, but I guess I didn't pay attention. But let's get straight into this. Fairy Tale 100 Year Quest, Chapter 67, Aqua Era, I think that is. I do not know. The kind the kind hearted king of another world, Mystican. Story, Hiroshima, Art, Atsuo Ida. The moon god, the, the moon dragon god, Selene. That's one of the five dragon gods, right? Don't say that out loud. Well, if it's in front of if it's in front of people from Edelis, I guess it's fine. I never imagined we hear the name in this place. Question mark. <laughs> Basically, we're in the middle of a job to chase after that dragon. Please excuse me. Now you're speaking politely. You know about you know about Celine, Mystican? That's your majesty to you. I don't know much. Other than that, other than that, it's a dragon that travels between dimensions. However, our records say that the Anima, Anima, I don't, I don't remember how to pronounce it. Anima project was determined to be unsuccessful if a dragon god existed. I guess that dragon could come to this world to regain any magic power that was taken from it, right? If this is Alintir, if this is, if this Alintir world as rich with magic power as Earthland, that world known as the Transcendental Magic World, it's the exact opposite of Edland. It is said that it has so much magic power that it is overflowing. So it has way more magic power than Earthland? But it's so normal for our world to have so much magic power. It doesn't even register when I'm told there's even more. Edelis, Earthland, Elinter. What are you imagining, imagining a Nazi saying? Hmm, what's that? Look at all shocked. A ring of water? Your majesty, stay back. <laughs> the fact that she hit him. Toka. Happy small. Thank goodness you're all right. Whoa. Carla don't look happy, y'all. <laughs> I wonder if she's going to get jealous and we're going to get um our ship. Because I feel like they're just developing all the chip ships in the Fairy Tale Hunter Year Quest. And Exceed? What was that magic just now? So you're feeling better? That's good. But why are you here? And how'd you get here? I was con I connected our worlds with Aqua Area, that magic from before. Although it was rather difficult. Now, please allow me to explain what is happening from start to finish. I came from a world known as Alentir. My race is called the Exceed. Alentir? We were just talking about that. So there are Exceeds in Alentir? Yes, although when I said I came here, it would be more ac accurate to say I was brought here. I was likely taken over by the White Wizard in Alentir. I also just learned that the White Wizard is a human from Alentir. The White Wizard used my body in Aqua Era to come to Earthland. For what purpose? That I, that I don't know. It was all so I could save Alentir. When we woke up in Earthland, our personalities had become unstable. Sometimes I was myself, sometimes I was myself, and other times, I was the white wizard. My memory was also hazy. But thanks to Wendy Small, we were able to return to normal. 
When the white wizard woke up, she used all Qua era in an unstable state, sending herself and all of you here. What? I get it, Toka. The White Wizard by Wendy Mumble. Hey, don't fall asleep just because the explanation is complicated. Just like Nazu. I believe she actually meant to send you to Alentir, but she failed and brought you to Elis. Why would she do that? Before, she used Aqua Era. If Nazu is small and the others, if they could defeat Alderaan, then they may be able to save, Al and save Alentir. Save Alentir? Hold on a minute. She didn't even ask us if we could, and she still blew it. Regardless of whether we save it, what she did was incredibly brash. This is the white wizard we're talking about. Is Alentir in danger? No, it was the definition of peaceful when I was there. That's why I can't understand what the white wizard was thinking. I don't really get it, but let's go back to Earthland for now so that we can interrogate the white wizard. Let's also take Nasha back. <laughs> That's so cute. We're not doing that. That's right. We're only going to take Grady back. <laughs> not that either. They need to go ahead and make their own. Please. So what's concerning is that the prop... What's, so what's concerning that there are two problems. Problems. As I said earlier, the White Wizard is also an Elvis. I can't leave her alone and I don't even know where she is. And there is another problem that is more serious. Not even I can use magic in Edelus. In other words, I cannot use Aqua Era to bring us back to your world. <laughs> what about Anima? That was also created using a small amount of magical power. You mean we can't go back? What should we do? Wait, Exe. Your Majesty, surely... Your Majesty, surely you still had one x -Vault left, did you not? So close. <laughs> x -Vault. oh yeah, the thing Mystic and gave us last time we came to Edelus. Correct. It's a medicine that allows humans from Earthland to use magic in Edelus. Or is it come? Bring it to me. Roger. Are you sure about this, Mystican? I get to help you, all of you again. Nothing would make me happier. We'll ask Fairy Tail to help us find this wizard, this white wizard. Their delivery next network is spread all over the continent. Your Majesty, we've received word that the woman in question appears to be under Fairy Tail's custody. Oh, all right, let's get going. Thank you for your help, Miss Again. I never imagined we'd see each other again. This has truly been a pleasure. While you seem to be going through troubling circumstances, I'm certain you will be able to overcome it. Right, thank you so much. Give my regards to Lily and the Master. Take care. As of all, all of you as well. Scarlet, is there a version of His Majesty in your world? Treasure him well. Of course. <laughs> I feel like they're hinting at Jersey so much ever since the law um, came back. Well, it didn't come back, but since they kind of met up in the manga. Over here, Edo Wendy. The White Wizard? You, without us asking, how could you? Natsu, calm down. I'm sorry, I had lost my composure. Will you talk to us about yourself and your purpose? My name is Ferris. I am from Alentor. I came to Earthland a few years ago with a certain purpose. That is strange. According to the law, you have been in Earthland since a hundred years ago. It was around then that you formed the White Magic Cult. That was not me. The leader of the White Magic Cult rebelliously apparently went by the title of White Wizard, but it seemed, but seemed to be missing at the moment. I took the position using my whiteout powers and I pretended to be the White Wizard. What? You're not the White Wizard? So there is somebody else who is the real one? To whiten Earthland's magical powers, to nullify it was my mission. Why would you do such a thing? It was all to save Valencia. You expect us you expect us to believe that? I understand this, but it's simply the truth. Alentir will be destroyed at the hands of the moon dragon god Selene. So we continue. So we'll begin the next chapter next week. My thoughts, I don't really have a lot of thoughts today. Like, there's really nothing I think. I do think um, somebody's probably going to destroy that X-Ball to where they can't come back. Because I don't see them, unless they just wanted to give more hints to Natsu and Lucy and Gray about um, settling down or whatever. I don't see them leaving this world so fast like they did. But I could be wrong. We don't know yet. 
but i hope you guys enjoyed this video um more reactions will come soon and make sure if you like this video to subscribe and hit the like button i'll see you guys in the next one